Hello. We can't see your face, baby. I need more light, Hello. Hello. Get back. Move back. Hello. 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 We need more light, baby. You're in a car. Yeah. Yeah, I am. Hold on, Kendra. I'm finna go in the house. Okay. You hear the dog barking? Mama, why your dog out? Why your dog out? Oh my God, my feet. Okay. All right, this is way better. Are right, you going to sit down for us, honey? Yeah. All right, what's your name, baby girl? My name is Alexis. 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 Where are you calling us from? I'm from Pensacola, Florida. Pensacola, Florida. How old are you? Woo. I'm 35. Why you say all that? Because I'm nervous right now, but I'm 35. 35? You have any kids? I do. I have five. You have five kids. How old are your kids? I have a 16-year-old, a 13-year-old, a 9-year-old, a 6-year-old, and a 4-year-old. Are y'all about the same man? <sighs> My oldest one, biological, no, she has her own father. My four younger ones are all by the same man. And you gave birth to all of them, right? I did. Okay. Have you ever been married? I have not been married, but I was in a relationship for 16 years. The relationship just came to a halt in June. But my baby daddy is quote unquote famous. My baby daddy is wide neck. Is who? Wide neck. Who's wide? Neck. The dude that went viral from his neck? No. Yeah, you'll have to check him out. He on Instagram, but yeah, that's my baby. He's dad. famous? Hold on. He's famous? Yeah. How do you spell his Instagram name? Let me check it out. Damn, D-A-M-N. Why? Hold on. D-A what? M-N W-I-D-E W I D E N E C K. Oh, okay. So this is this your baby daddy? Yeah, that's him. Uh, all right, so you do got a million followers, and his neck is really wide. Yes. So which baby daddy is he? Is he the one that have you have four kids by or one kid? Four. So you four. So did it, did y'all break up after he got famous? Yes, ma'am. Why did y'all break up? Because he, he's a Excuse my language. He a man that ain't never really had shit. So when he got in the light and his women started coming at him, like it was a problem for me. You feel me? Like it's either we together or we not. And I have been like I said, we have been together way before he turned famous, sixteen years. It got too much on me, Kendra. Like it was, it was too much. Did he always have a wide neck? Yes, he was born like that. His mother carried him for 10 months and the fluid bagged up in his damn neck. He went to the doctor. He didn't want to get it fixed. So that's the outcome. And now that he's famous, he'll not act in a relationship no more. He don't, and he does nothing for our kids. Does he have any more kids besides your kids? He has an outside child that he just had like two years ago by a girl in Texas somewhere. So that don't co-parent well? Not at all. Not at all. So if you don't know who her baby daddy is, um, I'm about to show y'all the picture again. Um, this is one of uh, our kids right here. This is my six-year-old. That's what that's six Hi, baby girl. Hi, baby girl. So this is your this your baby daddy, yes. the one with him. My child's father, I just put the bitch in jail the day after Thanksgiving for a child support purge because the motherfucker don't take care of my kids, Kendra. So he's, he's currently in jail right now? No, nah, he bonded out, he paid the purge and got out. So he owes you back child support? Yes, ma'am. He owed me actually $100,000, but the purge was $2,500. He paid it? Yes. So is he paying off the 100000 No, ma'am. He has not made any payment since he made that one payment of $2,500. Is he going to go back to jail? Yeah, he is. I go to child support court March the 1st. I'm not the one to be fucked up with, Kendra. <laughs> why, Nick? You better make that payment, why, Nick? 
for you to make it wide and spread open in the jail cell. You better make that. You better make that. Listen, you want to wide that neck? Or you want your ass spread wide. I don't know what you want to do, but your baby mama's on my show telling me the business. And she's telling me she's going back to child support court March 1st. Now, it's one thing to have a wide neck. It's another thing to have a wide ass spread. So if I was you, I would make those child support papers. Yes. All right. Um, wow. Alexis. So this is Alexis Pensacola for the 35 Five kids. What you do for a living, honey? Um, um, I am a delivery driver. A delivery driver. Okay. When's your birthday, Zodiac sign? November the fifteenth. I'm a Scorpio. You're Scorpio. Yeah. All right. So we got to know you real good. So what kind of man you looking for, honey? I'm looking for an honest man. I'm looking for somebody who's loyal. I'm looking for a family-oriented man. I don't need no one to take care of my kids. I do that on my own. I'm looking for somebody who's there for me, somebody who's to take care of me. I say it once again, I don't need you men to take care of my kids. I do a damn good job of that, okay? I need someone who would possibly be willing to accept my five kids. If you don't want to accept if you can't accept me, then you can't, you know what I'm saying? I can't. I, I come with a responsibility, and I hold mine down. I'm looking for somebody to love me. Like, I'm a fun person. I'm funny. I, I have a good sense of humor. I mean business. You know, I stand on my word. Like, I don't know. I just, I, I want somebody that's real. That's me. I am a little hood, you know? I know you can't miss it, but hey, I am. I, I am. But under all this shit, like, I'm a sweet person, bro. Okay. All right. So um, you already got there when it came to your children. So like, I mean, that's something men say at times, you know, it's sometimes a challenge to date women with so many kids. Because right. Gotta... Like, hey, come on. I got five children. Like, no, maybe we can go on some dates, talk over the phone and, you know, maybe see where it goes from there. Okay. Okay. So you got to be able to accept your children. That's not negotiable. Um, what's some deal breakers? <laughs> Like I said, um, I don't want a cheater, man. I don't want a sneaky link. Like, um, those are things I don't want. I want a hardworking man. I don't want a man in the street selling drugs. Like, I'm retired from that life. I don't want that shit, man. I don't. You I want sell drugs. You should date a guy that sells your soul drugs. Both, Kendra. Like both. I changed my life. Like that's what it is. Like, oh, I, I was a hustler, baby. That's what I was. Like, but. That was when I had three kids. I'd have added two more to my collection. Like, so yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, does this guy have to look a certain way? You know, no, I'm not sold off looks. You see what my baby did a little bit like, girl, but hey, I'm not, I ain't stuck on looks, you feel <laughs> like I ain't stuck on looks, you know. Just be acceptable, because I'm not no ugly girl. I'm acceptable, you feel me? Like, this, come having that the match. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, do she, I'm oh, sorry. Does he have to make a certain amount of money? No, no he don't. He just has to be financially able to support his own head. Okay. Okay. Can he have kids himself? Yes, most definitely. He I don't want to save mama drama because, see, I just... I have enough of that bull crap of my own. What do you mean? Like, I just, I have problems with communication with my own baby dad. Like, we have problems with our own with that. Like, I don't want no man that's out. They got a problem with his baby mom. Like, my baby dad got a problem with me. Like, I got a problem But that's what you come with. I mean, he would have to accept that with you. Yeah, you know, not really. Not really, because I'm like, I'm transitioning right now, Kendra. I'm not dealing with that. Like, I haven't dealt with it since June, to be honest with you. Of last year? Yeah, like... I thought, I thought you said you put him in jail in November. I did. So you, you had something happen in November, right? No, the thing was, he... he I stay in Pensacola. He's in and out of town, so I have to catch that ass when I catch you. What's that happening here talk? Y'all talk? Y'all talk? No, ma'am. Jesus, he has to come see his children? No, ma'am. Oh, wow. Okay, well, back to you. Let's do the kid. Oh, does the new guy have to make a certain amount of money? 
No, I said that. I said as long as he's financially able to support himself, you know, hold his own, then as long as he got some kind of income, we're good. And I'm not talking about a street farmer's income. That don't count, baby. All right, let's do the kids we can. All right. I gotta get on this Kendrick cam, girl. He falls down sleeping, child. Okay, who we got to see? We take it close off. Got my kids now, y'all. Got my. Okay. I'm not too bad, though. <laughs> <laughs> so, Alexis, when was your last relationship? My last relationship was with Charles, and I'm gonna say June of June of June, June of 28th last year. Like that's when it ended. Like I have like no relationship life. I'm just raising my kids. Okay, okay. Um, and when when was the last time you was intimate with someone? It was in June of last year. So the last time you had sex with your child's father? Yes. Let me ask you this: Some people think that about this situation with your child's father. Do you want to reply to that? Um, I mean, I'm a mother of five kids. I get no help. So if I am seeing a little bit of two guys, then that's the reason why, bro. Like, I shouldn't have to be made to take care of these kids by myself. With him being who he is, he's financially stable to help me. So what they talking about, Kim, they ain't walking in my shoes. I don't give a fuck about it. Nah, that. But anyway, back to the show, Kendra. <laughs> For real, like, bro, I don't have to address nothing. I mean, because a lot of people call us single mothers that deal with situations like I'm dealing with bitter. I don't think it's bitterness. I think it's like, what, what do y'all expect? I ain't get no help. How do I supposed to react? Okay, I got you. Well, some will say this. Now, let me just challenge that. I agree with you. But some will say, well, why have four kids by him if you weren't getting out? Why because, you stop after like I said, listen, you guys, before he became famous, we already had these kids. We didn't have my name. Before. He was there with you. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, he was. He was, okay. Kendra. Okay. Um, did you ever talk about marriage? Yes, we did. But like I said, when that when it came to the point of the public and the Facebook and the internet shit, it was like that shit was over with. Obviously, when it became to the fame, I wasn't what he wanted anymore. You know, like I'm gonna keep it real. Okay, okay. I, I respect your transparency, Alexis. I do. So why do you think? Why do you think you're single, honey? I'm single because. I mean, as you can tell, I got a little snappiness to me. Like, I mean, but I'm going to put it like this, Kendra. I'm like this because I feel like I've always had to wear the pants. I've never, like, been able to be the soft female. I always had to be like this whore. Oh, so, again? I think your phone, your phone, your phone, your phone um, Pro, say that last part again for me, baby. Okay, I think with me having to wear the pants in a relationship and be all tough skin and stuff, I think that has a lot to play a part in it. I don't think men know how to approach me. Um, I don't think I know how to be approachable. You know, they say I always keep a unit on my face like I'm mean, so I don't know. Okay. Well, why would it got, go ahead. Why would it gotta be like it to be with you? I'm a fun, I'm a loving person, I'm faithful, you know, I cook, I clean, I take care of my kids, I do that, like, all the womanly things, I do that, you know, I like to go out and have fun, I got a funny side, I'm goofy as hell, like, it's just, you know, it's always a vibe around me, I'm a whole vibe. She's a whole vibe, she's a whole vibe. This is Alexis Pensacola, Florida, 35, um, she's five kids, oh, do you want more kids? No, ma'am. No more kids. He can have kids. She's a Scorpio. She drives. You're a delivery driver, correct? Yes, ma'am. All right. She was very, very open and transparent with us. She is the child's mom to Y Neck. Um, I didn't know who he was, but I do know now he went viral. So he. I've been trying to get on here a long freaking time. <laughs> well, you finally made it, boo. You finally made it, and he is not doing his daddy duties. 
So this is this is her side to the story. Um, so let's do it, Alexis. So what's the age range you would date? You're 35. Oh, um, 35, probably from like 30 to 38 ish. I don't really, I'm not too pressed about older men. Like, okay, 30 to 38. And does he have to be in Pensacola, Florida? No, he does not. He can be, I prefer you to be close, like surrounding areas somewhere, but you know, I do travel myself, so. You know, I, I, I travel, I drive, because I'm a smoker. I can't be on those smoke folks plane blowing no bad gas. So I will come. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, let's do it, girl. You're the guy that is wanting to reach out to you, your Facebook page. Okay. Um, those of y'all that don't know, I'm up on the big pressure. That's B-I-G-P-R-E-S-S-U-R-E. -E. I'm also... um. Y'all can check me out on TikTok. I'm Big Pressure 87. Big Pressure 87. Okay. Well, listen, you keep me posted on the update, and you say you're going back to Child Support Court March 1st? I am. Okay, March 1st. Okay. Well, you keep me posted how it goes, honey. I will. Thank y'all. You're welcome. Bye, boo. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. I don't want no problem. Loves. I don't want no problems. I don't want no problems. Why not? Why not? Listen to me when I tell you she gonna put your ass back in jail. Make them child support payments. Like I said, you gonna have a wide neck and a wide ass spread. Pick and choose. You don't want both. You don't want both. You know you got the money. Take outside of paying the child support payments. Go see about your kids. Go to the bank and take away from your kids. Why not? Now, I'm just going off what she told me. I don't know your side of the story. So I could do is tell you what she said to me. But if what she is saying is accurate, go be a bounty to your kids. And make them child support payments because she coming for that ass. All right? Oh, yeah. Let's keep going, child.